Yes, Anderson Silva versus uh, Jake Paul. It's actually happening Saturday, October 23rd. It's going down, man. Uh, it's going to be, I think it'll be a great fight. Um, people are dismissing Silva. I don't know why, you know, Silva used to be MMA cha middleweight champion for a long time, you know. Um, he's the reason probably people go into MMA. Like, um, and yeah, he destroyed everyone, didn't he, back in the day, man. He's like, he's like a mate, he's like, when you're fighting, it was like being in the Matrix. The guy used to have amazing head movement, just uh, refle amazing reflexes and all that. And then once they left, you know, he got knocked down. He had a few injuries and that was it, wasn't it? Um, but now he's doing boxing. His boxing career started well, and he's, he's, I think he, he's knocked all his opponents out. And recently he beat um, Chavez Jr. And he's, he's a guy who used to be a world champion in middleweight. Uh, Chavez, you know, I think it's middleweight, super middleweight, one of them, he was, he was a world champion. Uh, so he's beat a legit boxer that Jake Paul's never done really, has it? Jake Paul's not really beat a legit boxer, has he? Uh, Anderson Silva has, he's beat Chavez. Even though Chavez has had issues, problems, he's, he's still a world champion. At the end of the day, you know, Silva's, you know, he's skillful, good mover, he's got, you know, he looks like he's got power, uh, he's boxing. Plus, he's with boxing, all he's got to do is just concentrate on hands and boxing. Um, he's not worried about getting taken down like in MMA. He's not worried about anything else. Um, Jake Paul, you know, he's got the power, hasn't he? He's built, he's built his following, knocking people out. You know, he's beat uh, some MMA fighters, but most of those guys, they're not on the level Anderson Silva in terms of their boxing. Like, um, what's his name? Wood Woodley was decent. Woodley had decent hands, but, you know, um, what's it called? Jake Paul knocked him out in there. Woodley's decent with Silva, I'd say he's a better striker uh better boxer than Woodley um like I said he's beat a, a, a fighter beat, he's beat a boxer whether he, the guy was you know not the same whatever he still beat a boxer a legit boxer whereas Jake Paul's only fought boxing he's supposed to fight Hassim Rahman Jr and it, it didn't happen for some reason so um because of the weight issues whatever but it didn't happen did it but that was that would have been his first real test in it do you know what I mean um he's knocked everyone out he's obviously improved He's taking boxing seriously, um, and he's getting better, isn't he? Um, what's his name? Um, Jake Paul. So Jake Paul, you know, people, um, like I said, are dismissing his fight. Um, cause Silver's forty seven. Like I said, um, he's an he's still so an MMA fighter, but like you know, it's still I still think it's a tough fight for Jake Paul, isn't it? It's a tough fight for him. He could lose this fight. I feel like, um, but obviously. You know, the public pick is silver for a reason, like I said, because he's older and all this bullshit. But it could be like cherry. It's not really a cherry pick. He's fighting an MMA legend, and like I said, the guy was was, was just he was he was known for his boxing in it, boxing striking, one of his fucking strengths in it. So um, silver's gonna be ready. Silver has a passion for winning, and I don't think he's gonna. Uh, I don't think he's gonna sell out. Basically, people have been saying that. Oh, the like Woodley sold out. And all this shit. I don't think so. I think um, it's going to be a great fight. <laughs> you know, the angles of silver could be too much for Jake Paul. The speed of silver. Like I said, Jake Paul could... He's got the power to knock out silver. He does have the power. Um, silver's chin, you know. You know, it's not the greatest, is it? Like in MMA, in recent, recent events. Recent, his recent fights, you know. He's been knocked out in there and all that. He's been hurt a few times. But in this is boxing. This is, you know... It's a different sport. Like I said, there's not to worry about the kicks, the takedowns. Do you know what I mean? And all that. So, I don't know. I think it's a great fight. Um, I think uh, it's going to be a tough one for Jake Paul, man. I think I think he's going to be in for a long night, innit? If he doesn't knock out Silver, he's, gonna, he's probably going to lose on points, I feel like. But it's a great fight. I don't know who I'm picking. I don't know. You know what? I'm going to go find this on Silver. Silver to beat uh, Jake Paul on points.